Today, we're going to talk about your 10th week of being pregnant with twins. I'm Natalie Diaz, founder of Twiniversity, the world's number one website for parents of twins, and I'm also the author of a little book called What to Do When You're Having Two. I'm so excited to talk about all the things that you're going to be experiencing during your 10th week of your twin pregnancy. We're also going to chat about some things that you might want to do this week and finally give you some tips on how to make this week a little bit easier for you in your 20s. So congratulations, you are 10 weeks pregnant with twins. Let's get into some of the symptoms that you might be experiencing. Okay, so first of all, I shouldn't have to tell you this, but you may be experiencing some extreme exhaustion, like extreme exhaustion, like it should be like a Netflix series about how tired you are. This is really because, um, gentle reminder, you're literally growing two humans right this second as you're watching this video. So of course you're gonna be a lot more tired. So that's number one. So if you experience extreme exhaustion, know that you aren't alone. That is what the majority of Twiniversity moms feel at this time during your 10th week. You may also be experiencing a lot of nausea. That is totally common during your 10th week of pregnancy. So don't get too nervous, but if you're like, oh my gosh, it's too much, I can't keep anything down, and you're worried you may be getting dehydrated, please make sure that you call your doctor. If you've noticed that your breasts are a little bit more tender than usual, that is all also very, very typical. Your whole body is changing. Your whole body hormone structure is going into a little bit of a tailspin as your body adjusts to caring for these two babies. So if you've noticed that you have a little bit of soreness in your breasts, don't be too alarmed, um, but it is kind of typical for your 10th week of pregnancy. Now you could find more symptoms that you would experience for your 10th week of twin pregnancy over at twiniversity.com slash pregnancy timeline. People are always like, Nat, what should I do in my 10th week of pregnancy? Well, number one, the very first thing that you should be doing, which I recommend, is you should plan a baby's budget. What? People have a budget when you buy a home and people have a budget even for grocery shopping. But for some reason, whenever we get pregnant or whenever we start planning a nursery, the sky's the limit as if we just won mega millions and have $87 billion to spend on a nursery. So realistically, sit down with your partner, with your family and figure out what your twins budget should be. If you haven't already, you really need to drink about 128 ounces of water a day. Yes, that is a lot of water, but you need to stay hydrated. Dehydration during pregnancy is a huge issue, like, like a huge, huge, huge issue. So please don't let this happen to you. So another thing you should do this week, go out, get yourself a really nice water cup. It could be fancy of, you know, fancy pants, Waterford crystal, or you could buy, you know, a Yeti cup, or you could just get a gallon of milk that you finished, rinse it out and drink out of there. But invest perhaps in a nice glass and maybe if you have a nice kind of drinking vessel, you'll actually drink more. Another thing we really recommend that you do during your 10th week of twin pregnancy is talk to somebody. Sometimes anxiety might wave over you and you get nervous about, are the twinnies okay? Are you gonna be able to do this? Is your body gonna be able to handle it? Relax, but talk to somebody. It's really good to talk to somebody and kind of get a lot of that aggravation, stress, and just that whole heebie-jeebies of being pregnant out. But you really should always keep the doors of communication open because I'm telling you now, you're gonna need whoever you're talking to to really be good listeners. So let them have some practice. Start speaking to them now. So if you're wishing that there was some kind of expecting twins class, relax. There is. It's taught by us. Twiniversity offers expecting twin classes in person and online that are created exclusively for expecting and new parents of twinnies. Taking a Twiniversity expecting twins class is not a traditional birthing class. We focus on real things that you need to know to get ready for your twins delivery and get you through for the first six months. I'll give you super practical tips for pregnancy, delivery, postpartum recovery, and raising your babies all the details that you'd want in expecting twins class, but you didn't know that you actually wanted because there's not that uh, that much out there. So there you go. Don't forget, we also have an online twins breastfeeding class and you gotta check that out too. So go to twiniversity.com slash classes for all the details. All right, what are our top three tips for your 10th week of your multiple birth pregnancy? 
Number one, it is a really good idea to see a nutritionist. I bet you didn't even know that your health insurance probably covers a nutritionist visit during your pregnancy. It does, or I should say, it usually does, because of course you never know what insurance companies are doing at this time on this day. But seeing a nutritionist early on in your pregnancy is gonna lay the groundwork for you to make sure that you are nutritionally sound throughout your entire pregnancy. So start looking for one now, even if you don't go, at least know if your health insurance would cover it, and if they do, who you would go to if you wanted to. Eat small meals often. Please do not go to McDonald's and get 19 burgers, 15 fries, 18 things of soda. This is not the time to eat like that, okay? I want you to eat kind of good, healthy, balanced meals, and I want you to eat them often. Remember we talked about nausea? That is a thing. So eating smaller meals often and keeping your belly full will really help with the nausea. Finally, do not wear anything uncomfortable. So your belly might be starting to pop a little bit at your 10th week. So if you're like, oh, my jeans, I can't button them anymore. They're screaming for their life. Don't, don't wear your jeans. Invest in some attorney clothes. It is never too early to wear them. We want you to be comfortable. This is the time to be comfortable. So if you haven't already, think about what you're gonna wear when those jeans don't want a button anymore. So that's your 10th week of pregnancy with twins. There is so much more down the road. We're gonna cover every single week for you and take you by the hand along this journey, I promise you. Don't forget to head on over to twiniversity.com slash pregnancy timeline where we have your twin pregnancy week by week. We even have a newsletter for you to sign up, by the way. You could go to twiniversity.com slash subscribe and all that information is there and we'll drop it into your inbox every week just in case you forget to come by and visit me over here. We also have some fantastic podcasts that you are going to love hosted by me. Yay. Yay, yay, yay. And we're featuring baby experts and parents just like you. So visit twiniversity.com slash podcasts to subscribe for free. And last thing, make sure that you like this video and it would not hurt you to subscribe as well so you always know when a new video drops. Once again, I'm Natalie Diaz. Thanks so much for joining us today. Congratulations on your 10th week of your twin pregnancy. We can't wait to see you for week 11. See you later, alligators.